So we're now at the new palace of Helen Kiemsi, which is the uh, palace of Ludwig II of Bavaria. And uh, this palace, this was the third palace which was built after New Schwanstein, which many people call the Disneyland Castle of Germany, and also the Linderhof, which is just outside of the uh, town of Oberammergau, very famous for its passion, passion play held every 10 years. So we're just having a quick look at the fountains and also the gardens of uh, Herrenkiemsee. So inside the palace it is uh, it's very very well worth to take a tour. Lasts about 30 minutes and the tour uh, will take you through the Hall of Mirrors which is nearly 100 meters long uh, decorated with uh, some 40 chandeliers or candelabras we should say uh, which would hold around 2,200 candles. It used to take between 30 to 40 servants uh, half an hour to light all these candles. Everything had to be lit by hand. And the amazing thing was, uh, the person who was mainly here, or the only time they were lit, was when uh, King Ludwig II was here, and more or less he was just here on his own. So, quite an extravagance uh, for the king. Now, if you can imagine, all of these castles have come at a great deal of cost and it was Ludwig who just about uh, sent Bavaria bankrupt and uh, this was one of the reasons many people feel he was conspired against and eventually drowned in Lake Starnenberg uh, to the southwest of the city of uh, Munich. So as you can also see there's beautiful gardens all in and around this area which you can come and enjoy a stroll and very nice to maybe spend half an hour or so just enjoying the garden facilities of the Herrenkriemsi uh, island and the uh, new palace. So anyway, we'll just scoot back around to have a little more of a look at the fountains. The fountains perform for about 15 minutes and uh, 15 minutes uh, each of each half hour. So this, you should, uh, shouldn't have any problem to get to see them. But anyway, once again, just getting another final glimpse of the palace. There is also a cafe here, a restaurant where you can sit and eat, self-service, so nice and quick. And as I mentioned, it really is incredibly extravagant inside the palace, uh, containing some of the most expensive rooms uh, of, of their time and even of uh, today. So the, the bedroom alone of King Ludwig uh, had over five kilograms of uh, gold beaten flat so that they could gild uh, the furniture and the various decorations. So Helen Kiemsi, the new palace, very, very well worth a look.